Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Music and Tech. This is Kevin. We are continuing this series here in Surrender Field in Yorktown, Virginia. This is the place where Lord Cornwallis of the British Colonial Army surrendered to the Americans under General George Washington, who became the first president of the United States of America. And what you're looking at are the different cannons that the Americans took from the British as their trophies. So they are on display here. Yeah, different sizes, different lengths. So the munitions that they are using to to shoot at the enemy are just iron balls. I know that there are some variants which I'm not really that particular, but most of the time they are iron balls that are meant to smash anything on its path. If you've seen the movie The Patriot, there's a good demonstration there that I've shown where in the cannon was shot towards the ground so that the iron ball will roll and hit anyone on its path because the, um, the soldiers during the time how the battle is fought they are lined up in columns so when the iron balls are rolling it will smash any soldiers that are standing on its path crushing their legs and then in the movie it showed that one soldier got smashed straight smack into the face so it's really scary oh there's a squirrel there so something remarkable about this place is that they have preserved this location you can you cannot see any development all around here. No building of houses or anything that sort. You can hear some s something played on the speaker. Actually, in the place that we just came from, that building. And if you can see that in the previous video, there's a button there that you can press, and that uh, storytelling will be played to tell you what really happened in this place so those uh, fence is are where the soldiers of the British and American army are lined up so here's a beautiful picture that tells you how it looks like during that surrender Yeah, likely this place has been preserved as a historical site and it's preserved to maintain how it looks during that time. So it's like hundreds of years it has been preserved like this because uh, the British surrendered on 1871, I think. No, no. That not 87, I think it's way earlier than that because the Battle of Bunker Hill is in 1776 I'll pause my video here if you like this video please click like and then if you want to see my other videos please do subscribe thank you so much for watching have a good day and goodbye